Hello everyone, this video is about RFI and the topic website. First of all, open up your Firefox and configure Foxy Proxy to use uh, Bob Suit that I have already opened over here. So I've used this uh, Proxy CLA, all of these are for Bob Suit, doesn't really matter. Now I'll open uh, EH uh, for image results from. Head over the website that you want to target. Toxic tab, I don't want to intercept. Look at the Bob Suit video to learn how to set up Bob Suit. Now go over to RC server and let's wait for it to load. We have your RC server. I will just simply create an account. So username would be one two three one two three one two three one two three. Like this one. Exit. Maybe I have already created an account, so I'll log in. Over here you can see I can change my image. So browse and select any picture that you can. So I'll have a picture say this one. This is a simple screenshot, so 42 kilobytes. Or what I can do is I can select this 8 kilobytes picture and open. Uh, first of all you can see if I try to I cannot select none images. So if you want to select something else, any image, you'll have to change this to all files and everything. So first of all, I'll simply select PNG file. Click on upload. Now this has uploaded the file and this is my current image. Now over here on the target tab, select uh, rce.eh, that's called Unicus platform. This is the server we are working on and uh, we want to target the post request that is a request that allows us to upload the image so to select from post request right click then to repeater we want to repeat this request again over here in the repeater tab let's go one by one this is the header part so every FTTP request contains a header this is the header part in the header you can see it says boundary equals this dash dash long string Basically this means every data field would be separated by this boundary here. This is the first boundary and first data field. It says file name. I'm creating the PNG. I don't want this file name. I want it to be PHP file. So let's say I'll uh, have it exploit, E-X-P-L-Y-T. Or you can see payload, payload.php. So although this is the content of my file, the content type is, uh, it denotes the type of content, but it doesn't really matter right now. Here is the content, the real content. This is the PNG image as text. If you open this image in notepad, this is what you'll see. But I don't want the image, I'll remove this one. Right Here I can input my PNG, uh, input my PHP exploit code. Moving further, again I have a file name field that says 123.png. Of course I want it to be same as the other one, payload.php, so I'll say payload.php, right? Now there is, uh, I need to find some exploit over here, right? So I've shared a link to the exploit in the group as well, the link is in also in the description over here. I have written one exploit, this is simple PHP explorer. And uh, I wrote it using Android mobile phone a long time ago. So expect expect a little bit of glitch in this exploit, but this works. Copy the exploit code, go over here and paste it. And now let's focus on Bob Suit itself. Here now send the request. It says uh, HTTP OK and the uh, parent location is index. So basically, it means that perhaps our code has been uploaded. Back to our Poppy's website, refresh the page. On the profile page, it doesn't really seem that it has been uploaded, but uh, try to copy image location, paste it over here. Uh, before this, uh, make sure you have cleared your cache. So hit F9 to clear your cache on your browser window. F9, cache will be cleared. Or find a way to clear your cache. Also you can tap Control shift r to clear cache and refresh at the same time. Because uh, we are hosting a lot of Poppy's website on the same server, so we don't want to uh, mix and match of different sites. So just clear cache using Control shift r 
And it should take a while to reload. Now I have reloaded the file and over here it seems that uh, it, the image was not uploaded but uh, on the image uh, link if you right click and say copy image location and open that location over here you can see uh, now images are loaded very simply say images slash 123.png just the name of image if I remove the name of image the entire name then uh, hit enter I can see the all the images that were ever uploaded so here is Poppy's image uh, some Sadnik also uploaded his image as and image so I can see as and image from here so this is also a vulnerability this is called uh, file listing or directory or exposing vulnerability where you have uh, you can see all the files that has e ever been uploaded here is our file that says uh, payload.php I'll open this one and now see this is the explorer this is the shell I can go one directory back I can see all the files right I can go even one directory back now these are all the servers over here I can access LFI server from over here I can go back I can access literally I can access access a server the different server from here what I can do is I can delete any server I like so if I like to delete our RC server itself this is the RC server. I'd be able to delete RC server itself. Going one directory back, this is the uh, our files on the server, all files on the server. Easter eggs. So let's see what this file is. Click on view. And we have the <laughs> flags of all the challenges. So, yes, RC is very tough vulnerability. Going one back, see double dot is for one folder back. So, there are more folders over here, more folders going back current directory slash right so now we are on the root of the file system current directory is slash uh, on the url bar this what this shell does is if you remove the dir equals slash this is the payload.php you will get back to the e uh, directory images directory you can see this was the images directory this is where i stored images so you can go back and back and again of course uh, i won't allow you to explore the server or even check other servers the source code of other servers so what I'm going to do is I'm going to delete RC server entirely because this is really really bad vulnerability any website could ever have so just click on delete and now this will delete RC server entire file click on ok let's see if it was able to delete the file okay this was not able to delete the file I suppose click on RC server it is still there so this is because of permission issues so let me go, let me go to RC server and the application images inside images see these are the images uploaded over here let me try to delete the payload.php itself my current file that file i'm working on this is the file i can even view the source code from here i can edit and rename the file so i'll just try to delete this file yeah delete this file yes and now yeah you can see the file the payload itself is not found because what i did was i deleted the payload itself right so you can delete files, you might be able to delete folders, you will have an entire shell, you can do anything you like to the website. But uh, yes, of course, now I would be disabling this particular server, rc.ehcodingliquid.com, because I cannot risk the uh, entire Coding Liquid server falling in wrong hands. So thank you for watching the video. For Bob Suit, check the description and uh, have a good day.